Hello and welcome back class to the interactive digital media tutorial on making digital tile sets. When we last left off we had just created our basic dirt tile set and now we're going to basically create a, um, a variation of it to be used as a ground piece that your character can walk on. So it's very easy to do. The most important thing is let's zoom in here a little bit and I'm going to turn off the grid for now. Um, you can take a look turn back on later if we want. Here's a preview of what this looks tiled. So we're going to take our base dirt and we're going to do a little modification to it. And the way I like to do this is to actually use a new layer so we're not destroying what we've done before. So let's go to our create a layer plus button and double click. I'm going to call this layer grass. Okay, so we're going to make a little bit of grass for our, um, for our tile set here. And I want to talk a little bit about um, color theory. Now, when you're doing um, any sort of design work, um, it's often important to really pay attention to issues of color theory. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go right down into the, so the bluey greens here to get, uh, to get uh, my my dark my dark green color for for the shadows and the reason I'm doing that is because uh, shadows cast a slight blue cast on um, whatever you're whatever you're making I'm just gonna use a larger brush here and just kind of I'm just gonna block this in I'm gonna get pretty big with it um, remember this is very much an iterative process um, it will uh, It'll kind of adapt and change. And that's why I like to keep it on layers. So I've used this very much blue scale uh, green here because I'm going to actually be going up and pulling my hue up into more normal green and a little brighter here for my mid-tones. I'm just basically kind of trying to flesh this out a little bit. Um, and then I'll be going a little bit even more into the warm tones for my highlights. And I'm kind of just going to create a pattern here. Um, kind of. Da -da. That's starting to look a little bit like something. Um, and then I might come back, my dark tones, small pen. I'm just trying to kind of find uh, shape here, trying to define this a little bit um, as I kind of see it. You can just keep working, kind of refining, kind of, you know, blocking this out. And we're going to also put, you know, a few highlights here on the top. And then I'm going to actually come in and we're going to add just a little bit of a not black, I really want you to avoid in all cases if you can using true black. Um, so I'm going to come in and we're going to actually just go like a very dark green here. Um, the reason I do that is because true black, um, true black is just it's too strong a color. Um, I'm just kind of defining. these shapes a little bit. Um, if you're using true black, it's too strong a color and can actually really um, create a level of contrast that looks unnatural. And so going with like a, a slightly tinted black is often a better a better thing to do. So I'm going with like a very dark green here. And then I'm going to come in and click my light green here. And we're just going to add just a little bit more yellow. A little bit more, and we're just going to add just a couple of little uh, highlights, just in a couple places, just to make things pop. Um, that's actually looking pretty solid right now. It's it's really kind of um, you know you kind of play with it until you feel it. Kind of overlapping these squares of color, I find is sometimes a good way to go about doing this. Um, just gives it a nice sort of leafy, leafy, grassy look. Okay, so we've now created a grass style um, 
tile set here. And so let's uh, let's give it a save. So hit save and we're st Mario style dirt and grass. And we're going to save it to my gallery. Okay, so that's the next stage. We've created a basic dirt tile and we've created a basic um, top grass tile. Now comes a kind of a fun part where we're going to start taking those two things and working with them a little bit to create a um, what's called a, uh, a tile set, uh, a full tile set. Okay, so save your work and um, I'm going to just close this down here and 